In this video, we'll share the top 25 things to do in Maine. At number one, we have Marginal Way. This historic walking area offers a serene and absolutely beautiful stroll past the breathtaking views of the Maine coastline. The tranquility of the place is captivating, and the picturesque views of the coastline are a sight to behold. At number two, we have Cadillac Mountain. This mountain offers the best scenic panoramic view of Bar Harbor and the surrounding area. The top of Cadillac Mountain is a sightseer's dream, with a panoramic view that is simply unmatched. At number three, we have Portland Head Light. This lighthouse is a sight to behold. The majestic view of the lighthouse against the backdrop of the ocean is something that will stay with you long after your visit. At number four, we have Mount Desert Island. This island is mostly occupied by Acadia National Park. It offers wonderful hikes, both easy and hard, leading to where mountains meet the ocean. The island is a perfect blend of natural beauty and adventure. At number five, we have the Coastal Maine Botanical Gardens. This nature and wildlife area is a treat for nature lovers. The gardens are a visual delight and offer a peaceful retreat from the hustle and bustle of city life. At number six, we have Acadia National Park. This national park is a hiker's paradise. With trails that offer stunning views and a variety of difficulty levels, it's a perfect place for outdoor enthusiasts. At number seven, we have Ogunquit Beach. This beach offers large stretches and areas to bring your chairs to sit, relax, and enjoy the views. The beach is clean and well-maintained, making it a perfect spot for a day out in the sun. At number eight, we have Mount Batty. This mountain offers a great view for picture-taking of Penobscot Bay and the lovely town of Camden. The view from the top is simply breathtaking and worth the climb. At number nine, we have Perkins Cove. This geologic formation offers awesome ocean views. It's a great place to watch the lobster boats come and go, and the shops in the area add to its charm. At number 10, we have Cape Nettick Nubble Lighthouse. The waves crashing on the rocks all around you make this lighthouse a delightful sight. The lighthouse stands as a testament to Maine's rich maritime history. At number 11, we have the Shore Path. This nature and wildlife area offers a beautiful cool weather, bright sunny day, and an easy walk for half a mile. It's a great place to enjoy a leisurely stroll while taking in the natural beauty of the area. At number 12, we have Park Loop Road. This scenic drive offers beautiful views and you can see where you might want to go back to later. It's a great way to explore the area and take in the sights. At number 13, we have Pemaquid Point Lighthouse. You can walk out on the rocks, watch the waves crash, search for shells, have a picnic, and visit the lighthouse and its adjacent park. It's a great place to spend a day out in the sun. At number 14, we have the land bridge to Bar Island. The tide is 12 feet high, so low tide is the only time you can walk across to Bar Island from Mount Desert Island. It's a unique experience that offers a different perspective of the area. At number 15, we have Allagash Brewery. This brewery offers a variety of great beers and a friendly atmosphere. It's a great place to relax and enjoy a cold brew. At number 16, we have the Ocean Trail. This hiking trail offers views from Sand Beach to Otter Cliffs. It's a moderate hike that offers stunning views and a great outdoor experience. At number 17, we have the Portland Museum of Art. This art museum offers a collection that is eclectic and of high quality, with works by artists ranging from Pablo Picasso to local favorite Winslow Homer. It's a must-visit for art enthusiasts. At number 18, we have the Ogunquit Playhouse. This theater offers great performances in a pandemic-ready atmosphere. It's a great place to enjoy a show and immerse yourself in the local arts scene. At number 19, we have Jordan Pond. This body of water is a great place to enjoy a hike or a walk around. After your walk, you can celebrate with Jordan Pond House popovers, which they are famous for. At number 20, we have Old Port. This neighborhood offers cobblestone streets and great places to eat and drink, mixed in with the authentic fishing and shipping professions. It's a great place to explore and experience the local culture. At number 21, we have the Maine Maritime Museum. This specialty museum offers a look into the progression of shipbuilding from 1800 schooners to modern-day state-of-the-art destroyers. It's a great place to learn about Maine's maritime history. At number 22, we have West Quaddy Head Light. This beautiful lighthouse and its grounds offer trails for exploration. It's a great place to enjoy a day out in nature. At number 23, we have Scudic Peninsula. This geologic formation offers a great place to enjoy a picnic overlooking the ocean. It's a great place to relax and take in the natural beauty of the area. At number 24, we have Rockland Breakwater Light. 
This lighthouse offers a very long walk on an uneven surface. It's a great place to enjoy a walk and take in the views of the area. At number 25, we have Champlain Mountain and Beehive Loop Trail. This hiking trail offers a great experience for those who are not afraid of heights. It's a great place to enjoy a hike and take in the stunning views of the area. So that sums up my top 25 things to do in Maine. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.